In this video, let me tell you guys about this new Blender add-on called Stylized Forest by Casey Sheep. I think just from the name, you can tell what this is all about. So let's dive in and see what it offers. One of the standout tools in this add-on is the painting mode. It literally lets you paint your forest onto the Blender scene. Like, imagine grabbing a brush and drawing where you want trees, bushes, and even ponds and snowy patches to be. And the add-on will automatically scatter and layer the plants for you, along those strokes, I mean. Of course, this piece manually placing dozens of trees by hand, and it can do that every day of the week. On top of that, Stylized Forest comes with around 10 one-click forest presets ready to go. So if you're in a rush, or you just need some inspiration, you can drop in a preset and you can create maybe something like a dense fantasy woodland or a sparse peaceful grove. And voila, you've got an instant forest ready to tweak. And by the way, the presets are fully editable too. You can use them as starting points and then adjust things like density or scale to suit your scenes. Another thing I like is how alive everything feels. All the trees, bushes, and even grass generated by the add-on have built-in animation effects right out of the box. And to be honest nowadays, this is kind of expected, because lots of add-ons offer such features. This means that your stylized forest isn't just a static bunch of models, it has motion and life to it, without doing any extra rigging or animation, or simulation for that matter. It is great if you're into animation, or if you want an atmospheric vibe in your 3D illustrations. Plus, Stylized Forest gives you a ton of creative flexibility, I mean in terms of the look and the style. It comes with special shaders and materials that let you easily customize the appearance of the plants. For example, you can tweak the leaf colors, adjust box styles, or change the overall color palette, in addition to the level of tune shading. So the same tree can look totally different from a soft pastel fairy tale tree, to a bold anime style tree just by sliding a few parameters. This means you are not locked into one look for your forest. You can tailor it as much as you want and get the exact style that you are looking for. Stylized Forest also is packed with a huge library of ready-made stylized nature assets. You will get more than 250 handcrafted assets including all the trees, bushes, flowers, grasses, lotus pond pads, fallen leaves, rocks, and even some stylized ground materials. Essentially, it is a full box for building a colorful and painterly outdoor environment. As you might expect, all these assets come integrated with Blender's asset browser as a proper library, so you can adjust by dragging and dropping them into the scene. And despite having so many detailed assets, the add-on is built with performance in mind because it offers clever optimization options. This is the case in case you don't have a supercomputer to work with, especially with dense forest scenes. For example, there is a camera-based option that only generates trees and plants with the camera's view to save your PC from handling unnecessary objects off-screen. And there is even a lightweight mode that temporarily reduces the plant count by about 80 to 90% while you're working. In this way, you can still navigate the scene in the edit mode and you can do that smoothly on an average computer. And then when you hit render, all the detailed props are back to the final image that is. I would say this is a thoughtful touch, which makes the add-on feel really friendly, in addition to being practical too. Stylized Forest Generator has been out for a short while, but the feedback is very positive. From my experience playing with it, I can see why the tool feels like it was made by an artist for an artist, with a friendly interface that doesn't overwhelm you. So, if you're into creating cozy woods and stylized forests and nature scenes, this one can open a lot of creative possibilities for you, while saving you a lot of time and effort. So if you're interested, you will find all the necessary links in the description. And there you have it guys. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also, please subscribe to the channel to receive more videos like this. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.